Hey, what's up, y'all? Getting back to it. I'm chilling. And um, I just had a young couple in a, in a car. And um, they had a daughter. And the daughter was crying and yelling. And, you know, a young couple pops, you know, popped on the leg. You know, and was like popping. And she's like, oh, she's just so bad. And, you know, and I see, I see this a lot sometimes with people that I'll pick up and obviously it bothers you when you see it, it bothers you so you think about it but if I, I had to say something and what I realized was was this a lot of the time specifically in black families you know and I can't speak towards white families because I haven't been around enough of them to know or Asian families to be around enough of them to know what they do in regard to raising kids black families we tend to whoop kids and um we take pride in it. I was whipped when I was growing up. Everybody has a story about getting beat. And we take pride in it. And there's a problem with that. And and this is what, you know, and I didn't want to sound like somebody's grandfather or somebody's dad or whatever and try to, you know, put the dude in his place. So I did not do that. I explained that, you know, there are some instances where kids, where we look at what they're doing as something bad, and it's not that it's something bad, it's that we are missing what the kid needs. We're missing what the kid needs. And there, you have to begin to look at your children, especially in black families. We got to start looking at our kids and saying to ourselves, what is it that I'm missing? What is it that my son or, or daughter needs? What am I missing? Because it can get to the point where let's say if your kid is loud all the time or yelling, you may be missing that your kid might be a future uh, singer. Now they're loud because they're learning to use their voice. But if you pop the kid, you're literally beating the singer out of the kid. You're beating the singer out of the kid. And if the kid does a lot of stuff with his hands, the kid may be a, a guitar player or he may be an artist and he always fiddling and people are saying, oh, you won't be still and all this other stuff. He's not a bad kid. Kids can't be bad. They simply are who they are and they're trying to decide and learn how to use what it is that they're going to be using the rest of their life. And if you pop the kid you could be beating the kid out of what their future is you could be beating the kid out of what they're supposed to be stop thinking that it's okay to beat your, your kids start looking at yourself and asking if it's something that you're missing you might be missing something You never know what your kids are going to be. Don't beat whatever it is that they are out of them before they ever get a chance to figure it out.